Little Cayman is located along with Cayman Brac, about 80 miles off of Grand Cayman Island in the Caribbean, Western Caribbean. Has a permanent population of under 200. Aren't too many places to stay here, mostly dive places. As you can see, it's really pretty. It's a very beautiful, calm day. It'll be interesting to kind of take a look uh, how it started. And this is one of the starting pieces. <laughs> it's called my wife, Andrea. Hi, Andrea. Hi, Sal. So, uh, what, you, what we do is we go uh, on the beach and we gather up possible material to put up and we stick it in the corner under our clothing there and a pile on some plastic and there it is. And when I go on the beach to pick up stuff, we have an idea of what our project will be. The stuff we picked up and rope and seashells and lobster carapaces and all sorts of stuff. So somehow this is have to come together and become a project here. And here's the stuff we have to work with. Gladys provides <coughs> the paint, the glue gun. We bring some tools, special tools for cutting through plastic that we've learned we needed. And so this is it. This is how it begins. Hi, welcome to our YouTube video. What we'd like to show you is an assemblage made from objects found on the beach in beautiful little Cayman Island. Gladys Howard, who uh, owns Pirates Point Re Resort, where we're staying right now, has for many years had a little contest where people are encouraged to make assemblages from uh, things found on the beach. And this year our project is titled Comedian Garage Band. So what I'd like to do is show you how it was done. This is our project this year called Comedian Garage Band. I'll take you through how it was done. First thing we did was find a base, and this is part of a pail that was found on the beach. We cut out the front and the top of it to make it look like an open space and painted the inside of it. So the next part was to decide what little characters will inhabit it. So the creatures you see here are typical underwater creatures you find in Little Cayman. We're scuba divers and this fabulous diving in Little Cayman. So I'll show you what these creatures are. The first one here is a puffer fish. And this was made out of some sponges. And then the eyes are made out of screws from a light uh, fixture we found. And the fins are made of some plastic. The puffer fish is singing into a microphone. The top of the microphone is made out of the top of a big lighter, the part that you click to create the flame. And the base is a straw or a piece of plastic with a bottle cap. The next figure is a uh, little critter that's seen down there called a fairy basslet. The fairy basilet is a beautiful little creature you see swimming around. And here we see it singing uh, into the microphone. Next to it is a trumpet fish. The trumpet fish is playing guitar made from a little something we found on the beach that looks like a, there's a butterfly on there. I don't know exactly what it was. Next to the trumpet fish is a Rastafarian octopus, mostly made out of a hunk of wetsuit we found. The legs of the octopus are made from the zipper from the wetsuit and then the mantle was made from the wetsuit itself and painted in the rust of colors and the top the head part of the uh, octopus is made of some kind of a little jar the hair is made for some rope that we braided and kept together with some glue gun to make uh, dreads and he's playing a guitar made of some combination of objects we found next behind the octopus is a juvenile drumfish, which is a beautiful little fish found swimming around. It has these long trailing fins. And of course the drumfish is playing the drums. And the drum kit is composed of two cymbals made of some pieces of plastic that were painted uh, to look like metal. The top of a jar and two bottle top caps with some straws and bottle caps to complete it. The garage itself is outfitted with things you might find in a garage. For instance, on this side of the wall of the garage, we can see hung up uh, kind of a plastic webbing we found. And I made a little skateboard with a peace sign on it. The wheels are actually made of some pills. The wheel is made of a piece of the wetsuit wrapped around something round we found. The ladder is another piece of plastic we found and painted. Coming down below, we see some sporting equipment. The beach ball and the basketball are made from the tops of different size roll-on uh, that we found, <laughs> roll-on deodorant that we found. 
and just painted to look the colors of the proper uh, beach ball and basketball. The baseball bat is made of a hunk of toothbrush I carved down. Small teeny little baseball there carved with, with little stitching. The boxes are made out of just some pieces of cardboard that were folded up and glued together. On the other side of the garage wall you can see some implements to take care of your house including a broom made of a toothbrush cut down and angled to look like a broom. A piece of a comb and a piece of plastic that are painted to look like a rake. A shovel with a piece of plastic with a piece of a soda can cut out to look like the uh, shovel. And then in the very back you can see a hose made of some green wire, electrical wire we found. And, uh, little piece of something plastic here painted to look like a nozzle. Now I'll take it to the outside. And here on the outside of the garage I've made a little trellis with some green wire and little uh, parts. The leaves are actually the tips of a crab and some hermit crabs there are on the bush. One of these bushes there that's a paintbrush that got dyed with green paint and this is my little cistern, the garden hose, the draining off of the roof. The water is hard to come by in Little Cayman, so you preserve it to water your plants. We have the other side of the garage with some more uh, plants and hermit crabs and another cistern.